storm continued east over the Susquehanna River into southern Lancaster County. That was a fast moving storm last night. Evan Papalis continues our coverage. Alicia and Valerie, the cleanup still continues from last night's heavy storms in southern Lancaster County. A lot of damage going on, like some that you see behind me right now. Trees laying in front yards and some even going through houses. Never saw anything like that. Nothing. Road close signs are plentiful in southern Lancaster County today after powerful storms hit the area last night, leaving a lot of damage behind. Many people have been without power for a whole day, but others have bigger issues, with some houses devastated, if not destroyed, by falling trees and debris. Marianne Hash of New Providence watched a tree in her front yard succumb to ferocious winds. Snapped off the top, middle to the top, and then it landed in our neighbor's yard. But the more memorable part for Marianne was the lead up to that moment. The tree did a 360, just completely circular, and we were amazed. She says trees littered the neighboring properties in the aftermath, giving tree cutting crews plenty of work to do this morning to clear them out. One neighbor with a lengthy driveway had telephone poles and trees fall along the roadway, giving him no way out. As time passed, more workers came out to fix power lines and telephone poles and to pick up the fallen trees. They've been here all day. There was numerous, numerous trucks here. Half the trucks have left. They were the tree cutters. It's not certain when all the cleanup will be finished. Homeowners out in their front and backyards are still doing work, and members throughout the community and companies are out helping with the cleanup as well. In Lancaster County, Evan Papalis, ABC 27 News. All right.